How are you win today for the academy? Uh, how do you feel about the team's performance? It was a really good win today. Um, it's always good to beat an England side. Uh, the lads played really well. Um, it's good to see the under-16s lads step up and then the senior boys play well as well. Uh, you captained the team today. Was it hard not to just have the kicking responsibilities, but the responsibility to, to get the team fired up for 70 minutes? Yeah, it's, 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 it's enjoyable being the captain. You can get in there and, um, and get the lads going, but also you've got to have a calm head from fly half. Um, but it was, it was really good today and we really enjoyed it. All the last played on. You've played a fair few under 18s games this season. Being only 16, has that helped improve you as a player? Because uh, you're playing with and against uh, a lot of experienced players such as Danny Hobbs and Tom Stevenson who played for the 20s uh, yeah, this week. Yeah, it's, yeah it's, it's, it's been a good step up and uh, I've really enjoyed playing him with, with the likes of Hobbsy and, and Steve-O and Sam Over and people. So it's really good to see them playing on Friday night in England in the 20s as well. So. Yeah, uh, talking about Sam Olver, um, he's been brilliant, brilliant form recently for the academy, mm -hmm. and it's paid off being selected for the uh, under 18s. Um, although he's maybe just like a year, two years older than you, do you ever go to him for advice, or do you look at him as a as a route you'd like to take? Yeah, definitely. Um, Sam's a good friend of mine, and we uh, we have some good fun on and off the pitch. Uh, it's always good playing outside and feel quite com comfortable. Um, yeah, but we get on really well, and he's, he, he helps you out when you're in trouble. It's good. Your dad was in the, uh, the crowd today. Yeah. Um, do you ever get nervous when he's watching you play? A bit nervous, yeah. Uh, uh, no doubt I'll get a team talk on, uh, <laughs> uh, before and afterwards. So, uh, yeah, it's all right, but you get used to it. So. First off, Rob, when you playing for England, uh, how was that out there today? Um, it was quite weird, obviously, because like, it's my club and obviously I'll play with them boys quite a lot this season, but uh, it, was, it was a good game, yeah, I liked it. So you on the score sheet. Uh, you saw yourself breaking, breaking through just on that try. Was it hard to not to celebrate after? Um, it was quite hard, yeah, because obviously it was what we'd been working on over the weekend and what we put into play. But yeah, it was, no, it was kind of weird. Uh, how's your experience been for in, 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 in the England camp? Um, it's been good to bond with all the lads from other academies, obviously, and play with them and get to know them. Uh, is it good to be sharing this international experience with some fellow, fellow teammates? Uh, definitely, yeah, because obviously I've been playing with them and we've all worked as hard as, each, as, hard as we can to get to this stage. Uh, how hard is it uh, to play against the club that you spend most of the time training and playing weekends? Um, it's quite hard, obviously, because yeah, you've been playing with them a lot, you know them quite well, but as we got into the game, it's, it just felt like a normal game. Over the past few months, yeah, you've played for the Saints under 18s and the 17s, and it's been a Daily Mail Cup, which we'll talk about in a minute. Uh, and now England in 16, you must be uh, enjoying the amount of game time you're getting. Oh, definitely, yeah, it's been great. Like, all the time, pretty much every weekend, just games, games, and lots of games. Uh, like I said, last weekend was in the NSB uh, semi final, beat uh, uh, Warwick School. Um, how was that game? Uh, was, you, was you fairly nervous going into it? Uh, definitely, because it, obviously it's the first like, major game that I've played recently, and we were 10 0 down even, like, in the first half, so obviously nerves started to build up, but we just plowed plow through. And, Got the win. You came up from 10 0 down. Yeah. Um, how intense for the last couple of minutes trying to hold the hold the lead, uh, trying to work down the clock? Um, well, after well, after we got up, we just thought we just got to stay in, stay defending, and just hold the win. Finals at Twickenham. Uh, it's definitely going to be a day we never forget. But uh, would it make it even better experience if you come off winners? Uh, definitely. Yeah. Like first, like, this is the first time in a speed got to the finals, so if we get a win. Even the bonus, 